Oh, Dan. I see you slipping up there. I see you slipping over the 10,000 bits to use it to redeem to get Jared down. And I see you clicking that button twice and clicking OK again to accept it. I see you, Dan. It's OK. It's all right. Hey, if we can get a little four hype train going before the stream starts, then you can put in a redemption to drink a whole entire drink before. It's all right. Hmm? Okay, I've got a glass, so it's easier to down my drinks now. That quicker. How's it going, everyone? You all right? Uh, we're back with Resident Evil 3. Uh, last time we beat the game. So now we're going to dick around a little bit on the new Nightmare mode that we've unlocked. Um, it's got revamped enemy positions. Uh, they're more aggressive. Uh, they're um, they're placed differently uh, all throughout the game. Uh, um, we've got a few changes that are going to be made. So we've got a knife. That's a heat knife, straight out of Metal Gear Rising. We're gonna go out with a brand new costume as well. And also, um, since we're gonna try and have more fun with this, because we've already had our blind playthrough of the game now, we're gonna we're gonna keep uh, we're gonna get rid of the limited saves. So when I'm dead, I get a chance to do a continue. And um, I'm gonna skip all cutscenes. I'm basically gonna try and get through this as quick as possible. So it's going to be pure, fair on gameplay, like, like full on. We're going to run around, we're going to knife, we're going to shoot, we're going to dodge, hopefully get perfect dodges, and we're going to hopefully keep casualties to a minimum. Uh, yeah, so it's going to, kind of going to be like a fun, almost like bonus stream, you could say. Um, oh, hang on a minute. Let me just resize that. <laughs> You know, a big blank void going around it. There we go. There we go. Fits like a glove. Okay, put back in. You demand a no hit run. That's not going to happen because this is going to be the most reckless run you've ever seen uh, during a Resident Evil 3 run, maybe. You know, one that isn't the blind playthrough because that was quite reckless and on its own, really. So, bonuses. Let's have a look at this. We got some things in the shop last time, if you didn't see the last stream. So we're going to go at this with one of the coolest costumes ever put in a video game. We're going with Retro Jewel Stars gear from Resident Evil 1. Looking forward to writing about in this costume. It's a classic. Look at it. Like, it's, such, it's such a recognizable costume. It's super cool. And we got the hot dogger. We have a wiener. As its name implies, this umbrella developed anti bioweapon knife is used by those who like to show off. <laughs> the blade can be superheated, causing the target to burst into flames. So, if you're a Super Saiyan who's really into his pride like I am, it's the perfect weapon. I think it's kind of neat as well. I think we had, I think we made a good choice getting the knife because it still involves a certain bit of risk because you have, you've actually got to go up to the enemy and stab them. It's not a throwing knife, you can't just attach it to a piece of string and throw it like a like Scorpion does in Mortal Kombat, unfortunately. It's gonna be fun to just run up over there and just stab him in the face. So there's a bit of risk here and there too, so it won't be too boring of a playthrough, hopefully. But yeah, this is a basically fun, non-serious stream. You guys can still do the game-specific requests if you want. Cause you know, I want you guys to have fun as well. But yeah, it's not gonna be super serious blind. Oh my god, what's around the corner? I've got a plan kind of stream. Well, I mean, this is a hard difficulty, so I probably will have to plan, but you get the idea. Let's go. Story. Um, is it new? I assume it's a new game. Oh, hang on, make costumes. Oh, we've got the classic one, too. I say classic, but it's not exactly the same as the classic RE3 duel. Yeah. Cardosa, what have we got for you? <laughs> No, he kind of looks like Brad Pitt there, but we can't get rid of the mop. That's something we cannot do, I'm afraid. All right, new game. Here we go. Nightmare mode. So, for hardcore fans of the series, enemies behave more aggressively. Their attacks are stronger, so I wouldn't be surprised if we get one-shotted by a single zombie. Enemies and items appear in different locations. That's right, items appear as well. So it should be quite a radically different playthrough from what we're used to. But I'm looking forward to this. It should be a laugh. Oh, but Dan, the classic one has straps on it. It's still ruined. It's not my perfect one. But it's still pretty good. It's close. 
but yeah, you get the idea. It's not the size that matters, it's how you use it. Oh, Ben speaking from personal experience. Good on him. There's a monster that looks like Nemesis. I right, can skip this. Gameplay. Give me gameplay. Inject it into my veins. What? A forced walking session? No! How could you do this to me? It'd be cool if there was an actual first person mode like this for like, the entire Resident Evil 3, like right now. Just Deus Ex it. Speaking of Deus Ex, there's a really awesome um, spring cleanup sale going on on Steam right now. You get Deus Ex for two quid. And I'm not just talking about just Deus Ex on its own. It's a director's cut. You get that plus the DLC for fucking two pounds, which is amazing. Because the DLC for Deus Ex Human Revolution separately is £12 on PlayStation Store. And you get it all in one for two quid on Steam. I swear, the world of PC is... is it's like Nirvana, dude. Then I can kiss this town goodbye. I've been missing out. I did a safety dance. Hang on a minute. I need to get to a wall. This wall should be enough. Alright. I'm going to press my back. Uh! Cause your friends don't dance, and if they don't dance, well they're no friends of mine. Say, ding, 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 ding. Hey Ben, do you remember when we sung that song during karaoke? We gotta sing that and what is love once more like we used to back in the olden days. Your Twitch description, age like wine. Is that sarcasm? Hey, look at the costume though! Look at the costume! Okay, I might let a few of the cutscenes play when they're dual focused. Just because look at this thing. Oh, man. It's got the beret too. Super cool. Hang on a minute. Did they do something really cool? I need to check something. Because if you look at Jill's shelf over here. No, oh, a beret's still there. I was going to say, imagine if the beret was gone because you're wearing this caution. That would have been neat. Mushy mushy. Hello? Jill, are, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Look at her. Look at this queen. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. All right, let me grab my... Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at that to be continued moment. How's that for an expert pause? Oh, dear. What the hell? All right, now we run. I'm gonna enjoy it tonight. It's just gonna be shenanigans and a harder difficulty. I will happily showboat for you guys because we're not doing limited saves either. Oh, calm down, Nemi. He's just mad because I fingered him really hard in the last stream. It's a pretty cool segment, though, not gonna lie. Bin bag, Nemi. <laughs> I think, uh, I think I prefer Nemesis's face in the remake. It's a lot more fucked up than what it is in the original. But I think I prefer the clothes of the original Nemesis. Just because they look like actual clothes and it makes him look all the more weird and fucked up. Whereas in this, he looks like a, a bin bag dumpster baby. With those rags and shit. Oh, fuck! There's a cool set piece. I like it a lot. What? <laughs> Jesus Christ! I forgot how fucking nuts this segment was. What's going on, Nemesis? Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on? Yeah! Hello, Eon. Hello, Embosh. How's it going, guys? Oh, more of the doors here too. How's it going, man? We're just dicking around with the new difficulty setting. 
body bags on him. Now that would be incredibly anime if they did that. That's a super Japanese thing. What the fuck? I say, hey, what's going on? That song's stuck in my head now. What's up, B? You okay? What was that thing? I'm fine, but you won't be in a sec. Let's speed up his death. <laughs> I don't know. One fucked up thing always leads to another. It's like Arclay on steroids. So in the original, Brad actually gets killed by Nemesis himself. And that's the Nemesis intro too. So you can already tell just by this opening alone that they've taken like a few liberties here and there. Not gonna lie, dude. This segment is pretty sweet. It's not exactly true to the OG one on PS1. But it's still neat regardless. Oh shit. Whoa! Am I dead? Am I dead? Am I dead? Oh! Oh! Oh. Well. Uh. This is what we're dealing with from now on. <laughs> Holy shit. Not even a second in and first death. Wow. What the fuck happened there? That's right, no coins either, so I'm pretty much a glass cannon. That looks good. I put it all into fashion souls. Always put all of your money into fashion souls, people. Doesn't matter about doing things good, it's all about looking good. That's the only thing that matters. Alright, so we're gonna ignore you. Have it to you too, Diddy G. That makes me feel a little bit better. God, that gives you no chance, does it? Resident fashion. Fashion evil. Oh fuck. You you weren't there before. You just fall in his ass. Oh, that was my last shot too. Do I have my knife yet? I do! Oh, that's a survival knife. That ain't the heat knife. I think I've got to go to a box before I can get it. Do combo, get triple S. It's a Capcom game. Do a Resident Evil 3 combo man video like a Sly Cooper. Oh, thank God. All right. Cool. Lucky seven. <laughs> you woke off that dead son. Baller. Super sexy sexy. Do a combo man in Celeste. Just spam jump on like a spring or something. There's your combo. Combo Mad of Celeste is uh, no death runs with world record breaking times. Those are fucking insane. I watched those. My god. Someone did it on the farewell chapter, which is baffling to me. This is really bad. This is already really bad! <laughs> Am I dead? I held A, it's fine. I have defense. We'll tank our way through the hard difficulty. Also, I completely forgot that I've got a dodge. Fantastic start. It's okay. We're late bloomers here. On one shot, please. Come on. Of course, yeah. Gold strawberries are a thing in that game as well. Just evidence that you're glutton for punishment. What am I on, by the way? Oh, I can't pause. Oh, Bloom, I can now put you on. Thank you so much. Graphics card. Whoa. Joe survives a lot of shit, man. Good old super cop. Oh, Wimbush. Thank you so much for a thousand bits, dude. That's lovely of you. Oh, cheers, mate. No worries, mate. We'll keep on working hard. As hard as we can. Definitely. Thank you very much, Wimbush. That's lovely of you. Cheers, mate. Is Ben still here? Hey, Ben! Ben, we got a nice message in chat.
There's a thank you. Oh, it choked me hard on Nemi. Wait, you're my son. That's not right. Fuck you, Nemi. <laughs> Mr. X was the daddy. Nemesis is the, is the boy. She's fine, don't worry. No broken bones whatsoever. We're gonna let this car scene play out because I remember it being really cool. Yeah, he's just mad because I fingered him too hard last stream. Oh! I figured if I'm gonna put my son down, I might as well teach him what the sex is. Or at least like halfway through. His fingers don't really count, do they? That's still really cool. <laughs> oh my god, Imposh. Yeah, mate, get on there. Don't let me distract you, whatever you do. Thank you very much, my dude. Hey, easy, lady. I got you. Who are you? What are you doing? And best of luck to you as well. Come on. Let's get you someplace safe. I like how Nemesis is just on his knees, like still whilst being brought up by a rocket Gandalf style. I mean, okay, Gandalf stood up when he died in Twilight Princess, but it's still kind of cool. Game developers, those dipshits. How dare they? Hey, what do you know about that monster? Nothing. I've never seen anything like it. But it's no zombie. It knows what it wants. A part of me wants to turn Carlos into Brad Pitt. What do you guys think? He's all yours. Ah, oh, but I love the mop. The mop is really good. I promise you're in good hands. What do you guys think? Should I turn, should, should I turn Carlos into Fight Club or should I leave it alone? Are you fucking kidding me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, 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 whoa! What are you talking about? I know what we should do. Okay, so mods who are in the chat right now, you guys, um, Irish figured out that you can do polls in the chat, so you could try that if you want, like get like a legit vote. That way, people who are lurking might get a chance to um, get involved too. No, I think by taking the hair away. Yeah, give it a shot. Give it a try. Hey, Captain. This fine young lady could use our help. Sorry, I just want to see Jill talk in a car scene with the stars in uniform. You didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? She is an elite operative of RPD Special... I'm Texas a member of stars. stars. Her name something valentine was that her only voiced line in marvel vs capcom 2 by the way nice pretty you, sure it was you. just her saying that i am ubcs platoon leader mikhail victor My right out there okay, first things first we need to get you geared up for f at first i thought carlos was going to give me the gun all right that'd be, that'd be weird chill valentine with an assault rifle ace in this game uh, crafting, bloody bloody blue. Yeah, we can skip all the intel because we know what's it all about. Because we know what it's all about. Because we know what it is all about. Hey, look, it's Madam M. She'll give you a good hand job. Do, 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 do. Do, hey, there you go. Jerry's done it. Oh, you just copy and paste a straw poll. That that works too. I'm pretty sure there's an in there's an in uh, website Twitch thing you can do with polls. But that works too. That's fine. Whatever works. Arash could probably tell you how to do it. Jill, it's me again. You topside yet? Working on it. So what's the plan? The old tanks got me clearing the tracks. Oh well, look at me climb the escalator when it's not working. Absolute rebel. Nerves. Yep. Oh god, that reminds me. Is my inventory gonna get nerfed too? Oh shit! Straight up! They give you the lightning hawk this early? Huh. That's. That's comforting, yet also concerning, all at the same time. But I'll take it. And if I look in the... 
I look in the supplier box, I think I should be able to get the heat knife. There we go. You can do some dirty tactics in uh, in Resi 5. Where there, there was a thing you could do where um, when you combine your ammo with your weapon, it reloads. So what you can do is that instead of reloading your gun and going for the really long animation, you just go and just combine it and then you're out and then bam, weapon's reloaded. It's pretty cool. Ah, oh, I didn't get a lockpick, did I? It's fine. I'll go back to it. It's all good. It'll be really cool if Nemesis appears immediately. That'll actually be really awesome because there's a severe lack of Nemesis in Resident Evil 3. If he appears right here and now, that'll honestly be fantastic. That'll be really cool. Let's have a look see. Ah, hot dog! We have a wiener! Oh my god, it's strapped to a hip. It's it's massive as well. It looks like that's not even like a proper like knife. That's like um what's the what's the Majima's knife called again? It looks like that. I think it's called a Nodachi or some shit. Which is a bigger longer knife. It's a longer knife but a shorter sword, pretty much. It's just attached to her back. That's kind of cool. My god, how is her arse not burned with that on her hip though? That's <laughs> pretty funny. If you call that a knife, that's not a knife, that's a spoon. I played knifey spoony before. Uh oh, let's keep these for posterity. Use Chris as a human shield. Mr. Mr. Boulder Punch Man himself, that could work. I gotta remember that handgun is up and Magnum is left. Mob killed it? By how much? So the mob remains. Oh, no. I guess Brad Pitt really was an illusion all along. Ooh, that's kind of a spoiler, actually. Ignore me. Ignore what I just said. Oh, what am I saying? That's a fucking old film. Who cares? After one. Oh, there you go. Gotta get that train moving. Quickster, let's test this boy out. Oh, <laughs> fantastic. Oh, it doesn't even kill. Interesting, okay. It's pretty cool, but it's doing fuck all actually. Oh no, I picked the bad weapon. <laughs> oh shit. That's okay, it still looks cool. Remember the description for the hot dogger. It's for people who have a lot of pride. That's me. I will die a lot with this weapon, but that's okay because it means you guys get to have more fun. Not me in particular, but definitely me. I mean, uh, I can use it when they're on the floor, but if they're coming at me, I don't know. Unless they can stagger. Let me test and see if they can not stagger if they come at me. I actually bet this ain't gonna work. Let's see if this works. It does not work. They do not stagger. Yep. Okay. So that's for when they're floored. That's for when they're on the floor and uh oh. Oh, you know what you're going to tell me, Neon. I already know exactly. As soon as I stab someone, it's ineffective. I know exactly what you're going to say. There you go. Knife fight your son during your first non scripted encounter. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes. Okay. I'm game. <laughs> A knife fight with Nemesis. Oh shit. Cue about one Simpsons gift with the monk with the monkeys. Oh, not bad. Actually, the heat knife does a uh, considerably more amount of damage. So when they're flawed, the knife's coming out. And when I run into Nemesis again, thanks to Nino. Oh, that's a lot of Zambambos. I guess we're using this straight away. That's so many! Yeah! Oh, 
fuck off. Ain't got time for your shit. Open up. Thank you. God, five zombies in at one anyway. That's slightly bonkers. Ah, oh, see, if I had the lockpick from the shop, I could actually start bypassing all of this. No, we're playing the game legit. This is how we're doing things. You know what would be funny and upsetting if I accidentally hit the oil drum? What if I actually exp It probably explodes. Nice on fire. It would make a lot of sense if it blew up in my face. I need the who's. The what? The who's. Oh no. Nice to see you. Aha. Go down to Krispy Kreme Donuts. Oh man, God bless Tesco's. I say God bless Tesco's because in Tesco's there is um Oh <laughs> There is uh there's a secret cabinet in the shop. I'm fucking dead. Oh god, as soon as I took my donuts, I become a donut myself. There's a secret cabinet in Tesco's where they still serve Krispy Kreme donuts. Is what I wanted to say in a nutshell before I got eaten alive myself. Oh, that's, that's not a bad, that's not a bad checkpoint, actually. God, thank God we're not doing the five saves rule. This is nightmare mode. I honestly thought there were no zombies here. They must have all gotten up. Ooh, all five of them. All five of them? Oh, that's terrifying. Fuck that shit. Oh. Oh, and they're still following me. Please, please do not. I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, I went the wrong way. There's a bit I can go up here. They're not still climbing those stairs, are they? Oh, they're trying to. The in sync girl. Red nub. Can be useful. I remember this. <laughs> he died as he lived on the floor. Except this time he's on fire. Boom powder. Why not? Can you do all the bullets I can get? Still going for weapon mods? Yeah, I've got the heat knife going on. Um, speaking of which, actually. You get bonuses as you play the game, don't you? You don't get the bonuses when you beat the game again a second time. So we could top up on weapon mods as we actually go through this mode. If that's a thing. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> I have immediately regretted this decision. You know what? Let's go back. Did we do that, G? Do you unlock them as you play for the game, or have you got to beat the game again so the points register? Because we could definitely top up on weapon mods for funsies. You don't know? That's alright, we can just check as we go through, it's fine. I remember there being a Zambambo in here. Zamban booby. Okay. Let me see if Joe can remember this off by heart. He cannot. <laughs> Hang on. Let me get my resi paper. I can cheat because I've ruined the down. I thought it was 927. Uh, let me see. I've got so much. I've got so many spare sheets of paper now. I've got drafts of drawings. I've got notes for LPs. Uh, I've got fucking uh, <laughs> st 
statements from my bank. That's not good. Well, actually, it's more like interest rates that have gone up by like 0.01%. Oh, I know. Super scary. Where is my... Ah, uh, here we go. I was one number off. I thought it was 927. It's actually 937. I'm... I, that's actually upset me a little bit. I was one number away. Hang on, mate. I've already lost my count. I'm being dumb. You know, writing down the code for this Bolton has uh, honestly uh, brought to my attention that there's not a lot of puzzles in this game. Compared to RE2, this game has fuck all in terms of puzzles. I mean, there are puzzles, but they're all piss easy. If I'm doing well at puzzles, then you know something's up. Because all I've written on my Resident Evil paper, quote-unquote, is literally two, uh, two codes for two volts. That's literally it. Which is unfortunate, really. I, I sort of enjoyed the puzzles. Regardless of my raging at doing the jelly puzzle for half hour. Sad day where it's lost like the old bits of paper. Yeah, I've got so many bits of paper. Just lying about. Absolute state. Original RE3 had some tough puzzles. Yeah, it's a shame they cut a load of those out. I sort of enjoyed the puzzles in RE2. Regardless of how bad I was at them. It will LP a puzzle game one day. Don't go giving people ideas, Ben. There's quite a few puzzle games that people- ah! Jesus fucking Christ! Oh, I thought I could get him fucking behind her. I'm not dead, am I? I'm not dead. Shh, shh, fuck. Oh. Well, I'm dead. That's, uh, that's fantastic. Just let it go. No more tears, only dreams. Just let it go, Jill. <laughs> God, that made my heart skip a beat. Oh, shit. The fact that we don't know where enemies are now. Oh, fuck me. Uh, yeah, that's gonna put... That's a spanner in the works. It was mop here. Just close your eyes and see Carlo says you reopen them and bite into your neck. A far better outcome than an ugly bimbo zombie. This knife may look intimidating, but uh got up here again. <laughs> Most unluckiest zombie in all of Resident Evil. What do you guys think? Zombie kill of the month? I wish there was a piano prompt in this game. I sure did. That's just Roy Tops. Is that a Shante reference? I understood that reference because I played that today. Yeah, look at me. I'm now one of the cool kids. I just started playing um, the second one that came out. I think it's called Risky's Revenge or something. Super classic, super old platformer. 2D side scroller. It's cool. I like it. It's um, it's quite simple, but it, it's sort of what I enjoy about it. I've got a thing for the classics. For example, I played Yes One and Two uh, last week. Super old, super unrefined RPG, but the fact that you know that it's old, it, I don't know, it, it gives me a pass for it. But the music is fantastic. Got legit like guitar tracks in it too, and this was a Famicom game which was made in the, the late 80s, I think. That's sort of insane how good music still was back then. I mean, it's the 80s, so, you know, it makes sense. I'm more of a 70s guy myself, but you get the idea. Right, well, we know where the zombie is now, so we can deal with her. 
Justice for Shantae in Smash. Yeah, back and back then, Nell. Honestly, playing Shantae. She'd be good in it. She's got quiet. She's got the moveset for Smash, 100%. It would definitely go into it. God, she's right on the fucking corner. What a slag. Fuck off. That was a bad angle. Oh, well. Yeah, it's a death. She is a spirit, but then uh, there are other DLC spirits that became characters too. I'm pretty sure. Oh fuck, these guys are here already. Yeah, arms was a spirit, wasn't it? And now they're gonna make an arms character. He's open wide. Fuck it. Okay, still killed it. Oh no, it's still alive. There we go, there's a death animation. Oh fucking hell. God, he fucking launched himself up those stairs, didn't he? I think the fact that they clued in that it was an ARMS character, not straight up the main character from ARMS, who is uh, an assist trophy, by the way, Definitely alludes to the fact that it's probably not going to be the main dude from ARMS. I don't know her name, because I've never played ARMS myself. I'm really scared I'm going to get bitten as soon as I open this. Hello? And he's gone. Thank god. There's a lot of super hot fit gals in ARMS. If it's the Bayonetta lookalike one, that'll be hilarious. And if it's a ninja one, I'll sigh because he's basically the Genji of arms. And everyone sighs when you pick a Genji. Who the fuck doesn't? I'll go next, actually. Oh, it's the map. Look at that, guys. I've got a map. Oh wow. Oh wow. Okay. Dead. Hand grenade. But it's not like they're giving me ammo, they're giving me items just for the room ahead. Oh, a nice swordsman or cave story gunner. Yeah, if you're an indie character, guess what? You're go you're you are going to be uh, a costume. That's sort of the way it's been. Oh fuck me! Ow! Don't whip my butt. Oh shit! Hesitating with the magnum. Not a good sign. Got RE4 of this shit. RE4 of this shit. Once we're on the floor, you knife the fuck out of them. That's how it works. And a music track. Yep. Spot one. Oh shit! Come on, caution. Uh, I wonder if I can take him out of the handgun. Open up! Open up! Oh! Danger, danger! High voltage! Shitting bastard! Fucking hell! The combo! Not my hat! My hat's super cool! Oh shit, I think I'm dead. This is a gruesome death too. Oh, uh, uh, well, I'm one of you now, my brethren. Bam. Nightmare mode sort of redefines the game a little bit. I'm just digging it.
And that's on an unfortunate checkpoint. Is it just me or they've been a bit less forgiving with the checkpoints? Unless this checkpoint was already a thing and I'm, you know, the game's just harder. I got a new hat now. Oh shit. I got the I got the cauliflower head. Oh man, well so much for super fun speed up time. That was gonna be the checkpoints after story beats. Yeah, make more sense. I think it's just because the game's harder right now. Rawr, specs, every time you say raw, I think you're coming on to me. Not that's a bad thing. It's actually quite welcome. Hello! Welcome, dude. Yeah, it's been a minute since I played Dead Space. Well, actually, I didn't play Dead Space. Technically, one of my uh, my exes did. While I sat, I just sat in the bed and ate popcorn and laughed. <laughs> Technically, not played it myself. Who am I playing it, though? Got that over the shoulder horror aspect to it, which is what we're doing right now. Except you don't shoot the head, you go for the limbs, you never go for the head of the necros. Dead Space 1 and 2 are a blast. Yeah, I mean, they only made 1 and 2. Shame they never made a third one. I heard they made um, a useless spin-off game that was based on Lost Planet, but they never played a Dead Space. They never made a Dead Space Three, from what I've heard. No, and it never happened. Never a thing. God, we actually got we actually got Dead Space Three, but I've never played it because. We actually bored because we thought, oh, it's uh, it's co-op. Okay, well, let's play the game together. But then we figured out after we got it that it was online co-op. Yeah, the massive rip that was, unfortunately. A shame. It's a shame. Oh, that was a that was beautiful. Oh, you see that? Collateral damage, Call of Duty, mouth them shot. Oh. <laughs> Oh, room Dead Space and Call of Duty into a resi stream. What's going on tonight? What's going on? As soon as you go MLG, you ain't coming back. Yeah, EA fucked it up. And it was inside, uh, was inside, like, tension-filled, uh, claustrophobic corridors anymore. It was outside in snow and it's like, ah, it's not a scary environment. You want to be in like a dark, scary corridor like this. Let me see if I can grenade them all, actually. Let me give it a shot. Oh, but it didn't work. That didn't work at all. <laughs> can I push you in the door? Uh, go in there. <laughs> See you in hell, candy boys! Oh shit! Did I get him? Oh, they survived. Wow. Fall! Shooting the cooch. Okay, so they can be killed with a handgun. Ah! Whoa! Fuck you! Oh! Get the fuck out of my house! Jesus Christ! 
Anyone else want to be a hero? No. That's what I thought. That was pretty stylish, though, not gonna lie. There you go. How's that for triple S uh, high octane gameplay? I don't have the clippers. Can't get my boomstick yet. Handgun. Nice. Revelations 2 did co op alright by making one player literally unable to defend themselves. Oh shit. Uh, in a good way or a bad way? So it's basically a co op escort mission. Huh. I can see there being uh, some appeal to that. Just make sure your brother, your little brother, is the person who is. Uh, the guy with no weapons, and you're the one with the gun. <laughs> this must be the subway company's offices. Moira couldn't use guns. They didn't like get the person who could use guns to teach that person how to use a gun. Like basically. <gasps> oh fuck off! That's not fair. That's not fair, as Evil Three. What are you doing? What we got? We've got maple iced. We've got. Uh, sprinkles, that looks like jam, chocolate, mmm, that looks like a original, put that in the microwave for 8 seconds, you'll get a bright melter, oh fuck man. If you didn't like guns? Didn't like guns as in, uh, as is opposed to them, or, or just like, preferred other weapons? Because if it's you or I don't like guns, oh no, they kill things in a game full of biohazards, and that's a bit dumb. Unless it's like, I don't know, a backstory thing or some shit. She couldn't because she accidentally shot her. Oh, okay. So it's a PTSD kind of thing. That's fair enough, actually. Uh, yeah, that, that's a pass. I used to play Revelations 2. I never played it. I played Revelations 1, but not 2. Is Revelations 2 online co op or local co op? Oh, it would have been cool if Nemesis was here, though. It would have been cool. Um, oops. Yeah, I got a map. It was local. Oh, okay. The games whose co-op I want to be local is online, and the games whose online I want to be local are online. <laughs> nice. Oh, there's a safe room in the uh, donut shop. There could be a zombie in here. We actually can't rush through this mode because revised enemy placement. Don't get up, please. Thanks. I'm gonna combine these. Get stuck with handgun ammo for now. Oh, there they are! Oh, wait, fuck her! Yee! <laughs> Sorry. I make funny noises when I get grids. Yeah, I haven't watched that OP because obviously I haven't played it myself. But the good thing is that I'm start I've started to play XCOM 2. And uh, just after getting it, I heard that the Super Best Friends actually played XCOM 2 as well. So I'm looking forward to seeing how many times they missed 99% accuracy shots. That sounds like a good time. Pretty nervous. Oh, uh, ooh, should I use it or should I combine it? I'm going to use it. And I'm going to put the red herb in. I need all of these actually. I keep the space, it's fine. Actually, I'll put that away for now. Mm -mm. Cool! We got ourselves a checkpoint.
The XCOM LP is not an LP per se, but that's fuck about a bit and then they canned it. Or as long as it's hilarious, I'll still love it. Wow, I had a green herb and it didn't fully heal me. I think I remember that happening in the old playthrough as well though, so I don't think that's a nightmare mode exclusive. Right, as soon as we open this door, there are going to be five mouths after us, so we got to make sure we're prepped. Let's do this. By prepped, I mean just walk outside and shoot this thing. Oh, I got them all. I didn't get them all. Fuck you. See you in hell. Wow! Have grenades lost their effectiveness or have they lost their effectiveness? That's wow. You thought these guys were spongy and Ori too. I haven't yet, Neon. I haven't gone past the tutorial yet, so it hasn't given me a chance to actually uh, customize my soldiers. But when I do get a chance, I'm gonna name everyone after people in the pub just for a laugh. I've no idea what classes are and uh, what they do, but it'll be a laugh regardless, I think. Oh, that was a shot, I'll tell you that. All right, time to double tap. Oh, nice got range actually. Okay, nice got range. It's got range. Stab him from over here. But yeah, when I start playing XCOM 2 again, you're gonna see me in the Discord a lot asking you guys what you wanna be, what class would you like? <laughs> Just fun shit like that. Who's going to be the ace and who's going to be the utter failure, the liability of the pub, we shall see. He's dead. Cool. Cool, blimey, hand grenades. They've really lost their effectiveness in this mode. Where we going to go next? Oh, there's some stuff. Oh, it's the, um, the simple log. I think we've got to go to the fire hydrant now. Some stuff over there too we can look at. But I think I'm gonna go use the fire hydrant first. You will claim failure. Uh, pro tip, you can set each soldier to have a mini nickname too after a bit of progress. So you can have, say, our abbreviations as names and as, as with our memes. Oh my god. That sounds really cool. I love games that have got customization like that. Where you can just make your own army and do whatever you want, name them who you want, uh, give them what you want. Uh. Games with customization options like that made me giggle. I played Disgaea 5 uh, a couple years ago. Well, actually, I say couple, about five years ago, actually. It's been that long, actually, since I got a PS4. But yeah, that game's got insane customization options. And suddenly I've got little to no supplies in my inventory. Wow. Okay, yeah, this is a new mode, all right. Oh, cutters. Now I can get my boomstick. I'm whiz. I'm boomstick. And this is another episode of Death Battle. Uh, hmm. Put you away. Yeah, I've seen you name people with specs. Make sure you name a Geo dude bin if you get one. Alright, let's go and get the shotgun. Yeah, Jerry, do it. I'm definitely doing it. This just sounds like a laugh, doesn't it? All the Zam Doom Doom babies are dead down here, so we can go past here.
It's a fucking meme. I've had two meme songs stuck in my head during the stream. The Hey Yeah Yeah song, and now I've got the fucking coughing dance. It's kind of a banger, though. I'm not gonna lie. Oh shit! Oh, oh! I remember this. I'm gonna forget. What? He's gone. Mm. Oh. Oh, I guess we're good. Wow. My memo throwing a curveball there. Yeah, XCOM is um is a strategy RPG bird's eye view of a grid. I like those games. They're alright. Plus I play a shit ton of fire in them, so I sort of kind of know my way around SRPGs. Sort of. Will it be as good as Devil Survivor? Probably not. But I still have fun regardless. It was really satisfying doing that. We got the boomstick! Yeah! <laughs> Why am I the Woolworths? Third person shooter XCOM spin off. Oh shit, I didn't even know that was a thing. SMT5, you mean the ghost game, which no one's ever heard of? I'm the walrus because the walrus is a fucking beast. Hey, I'll, I'll, I'll take that as a pass. If I'm beasting, it don't matter about appearances. I say, as I literally say 20 minutes ago, that it's all about looking good more than actually doing good. Say cheese. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, he's dead. I, is he dead? He's dead. Okay. I was going to say, that would have been really limp if that didn't kill him. I've got no expectations for SMT5. Because if you have expectations, they lead to disappointment. It's only when... Ah... Uh, oh. It's only when I see uh, things happening uh, on screen that look really cool that I probably won't be able to hold it in much longer. Because I've been holding in my excitement for such a long time for that game. It's been three years since we got a peep from it. Oh no, but we're working on it. Oh, that's fantastic. I'm glad you're working on it. Anything you can show? Oh my god. Get off of me. No. There is not. So until I see... Uh, Something conclusive about SMT5. I ain't getting excited. Same with Last of Us 2. And oh boy, you want to avoid Last of Us 2 online, that's for sure. Spoilers abound. George, if you're still watching this, by the way, I don't mean Jerry because his name is also George. Stay off Twitter. Stay off the internet. Do not look up anything about Last of Us 2. Because there are spoilers abound right now. There's a massive leak about it. So yeah, if you don't want to be spoiled, avoid researching it at all costs. Because from what I've heard, it's, it's pretty bad on there. That goes for you too, chat. Don't you spoil anything if you've seen spoilers. Otherwise, I will end you. Because I actually really enjoyed Last of Us 1 a lot. I had no expectation. Another example. I had no expectations for Last of Us at all. I heard it was a new game by Naughty Dog. I was like, oh, cool. It's the Uncharted and Crash Dudes. That sounds good. All right, cool. I didn't research it. I didn't, like, uh, look up anything about it online. And when I bought it. Uh, and uh, I was pleasantly surprised by how absolutely fantastic that game was. I super enjoyed Last of Us. And it's online was actually fantastic too. 
If that me and G, who I don't think is in chat right now, we actually played a fuck ton of the multiplayer on Last of Us. It was good. There was so much strategy and teamwork involved. And the fact that limited ammo was also in the multiplayer, it worked. It somehow worked. And it was actually a really fun experience. I miss this multiplayer a lot. The Last of Us was such a good time. Looking forward to it too. But I ain't gonna research it. Especially now. Oh shit. Hang on. I can remedy this. Last. I could use a herb. Yeah. Oh, Sarah's here. You alright, Sarah? Yeah, Sarah is like the biggest fan that we know of Last of Us, so definitely do not spoil that game for her. She'll probably stream it too. Did you ever get the song that never ends stuck in your head? The one that goes on, oh, not my friend. It was written by some people not knowing what it was, and Pete will keep on singing because it's a song that never ends. Yes, indeed, it goes on and on, my friends. I feel like that's a song that I don't recognize, and judging by the lyrics, I'm sort of happy that I don't. Okay, I think we're done with this area. Let's go back through... Uh... Alright, let's go here. Let's go for the donut area. Let's not save. I mean, God, our rank's gonna be shit because we've died a fuck ton of times. But it's about the principle. Batman's Bruce Wayne. <gasps> no, what have you done? You fucking sp God. God, that's like saying Thanos is Captain America's father. What the fuck is wrong with you? Haha, <laughs> that's a throwback. <laughs> Fucking song stuck in my head. That's the only song I've got stuck. Coughing dance, which is actually quiet. Hmm. Uh, I think I might actually combine the two of these to make some magnum ammo. The head of it. It's only three, but... God, the fact that you barely get any magnum ammo from combining those two makes it all the more painful when you miss a shot with the mags. Joe was the Ice Age baby? Oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> Where's the baby? Where's Joel? There he is! If I <laughs> God. Yeah, I always found that dumb with Superman law. Superman wears glasses. Oh shit! It's totally not Superman. Remind everyone about tomorrow. You remind everyone about tomorrow. We got a charity stream going on. And uh, me and Ben are going to be there. It's that Sarah stream. We're raising money for uh, Alzheimer's. And depending on how much we get, Sarah has to do cool, crazy, and dumb things. It's for a good cause. And we're going to make asses of ourselves throughout the entirety of the stream. So it'll be cool to see you guys there. But yeah, I've left it in the announcements. And I'll probably do a reminder tonight too. There you go, Sarah. Happy? You can stop talking to me in caps now. You little pissant. Now this is where Nemesis ambushes you when you come back this way. Suicide so like, note. Illustrations notice. Oh fuck, it's the dogs with dicks! Fire and electricity. I am Agni and I am Rudra. We can be of great service to you. Haha, <laughs> it's really just a make cry. Ah! 
Shit! Oh god! Stop it! Fucking hell! I was making a funny joke, you pieces of shit, and you slapped my ass off your tents. Oh man. Hang on a minute. Wait a minute. I mean, Ruger is wind and fire, not electricity and fire. Oh, I fucked up the entire joke. Oh, I've made an ass of myself. What am I doing? What an absolute fake Devil May Cry fan I am. That's it, everyone leave. Don't watch me ever again. I don't deserve your views. Oh no. Fuck off. Oh shit. Shut up! Resident Evil 4! I played it a shit ton! Haha! <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, fuck you, game. Get a lot of gunpowder this time around. Mordor has left the chat. Yeah, it was on sale. In fact, um, uh, Mr. Verified Chaos Extraordinaire Neon actually gifted me next com to. Just love you of him. Thanks again, dude. Had a lot of fun. Okay, oh, I remember this place. This is the one with the spiders. This, this is the bit where we get down with the sickness. Oh, oh God. Smells like, oh, I don't even want to think about it. That's okay, you'll be tasting it later. So I need blue herbs. No, I don't need- wait, do I need blue herbs? I need blue herbs, don't I? No, it's the green herbs. I can't remember. Guys, how does it work again? It's been a while. I think it's just the green ones, isn't it? Could be wrong. Oh, actually, I'm gonna put the gunpowder away. Just green herbs, any herbs. Alright, cool. They even cut out blue herbs from the game. What are they doing, guys? What are they doing to Resident Evil? Fucking... Oh god, humanity. How are people give you cool stuff and I give you deadly premonition? <laughs> it sounds like a laugh from what I've heard. It's one of those so bad it's good games, unlike literally any David Cage game that's ever existed. So I'm looking forward to checking that out at some point. Yeah, you did give me Dark Souls 2 Neon. That was a statement more than anything. I can never truly escape that game, can I? Now it's just very in my library, reminding me of what happened. I can never run away from your past. And that game is honestly a, a testament to that. It's the lockpick! Yes! Sir. We're all masters of unlocking now. Q 
You don't fuck David Cage, the cage fucks you. Hmm. I don't think we need the bolt cutters yet. Or we could put that away. What is a simple lock in the same room? I, I think. Oh, it's blowing me. Lower floor. Quickly nab whatever's in there. It's for Master Key. God, you really can't escape the Dark Souls, can you? That's where we talk about David Cage every single stream we do. Oh, I got an achievement. You get no points for guessing what the achievement's called. Oh no, I made the bad game. Fail the game designer. Oh Jesus. I'm so glad they called him out for what he truly is. Uh mm. We'll probably pick up a lot of green herbs in the way, so maybe I should actually store this. For safekeeping. Yeah, it's fine. Or maybe I'll put the magnum away. You know what? I'm gonna gamble it. I'm gonna put the magnum away. Oh god, we've talked about that, Eon. We've talked about that many a time and how weird and fucked up that is. God, don't even. Oh, don't worry, we're gonna get him in slide two. Mark my words. He will suffer. Oh shit. Let's watch this lovely cutscene again. So I like to gross you guys out. Oh, I clear myself out, you that's gross. Oh King's oddly sexual, man. Tentacles and fingering. It's all there. Whoa. Hey guys. Watch this. I think Sword Art Online is the best series to ever grace screens ever in the world. <laughs> agreed. Absolutely agreed. Alright, where we got to go next? Let's just go this way quickly. There's some stuff here we haven't checked out. Oh, someone clipped that. That's nah, fine, you don't have to. I mean, the heat knife looks cool with this outfit. I don't feel it as cool on Jewel as it would with her original costume. But it looks cool this one. Alright, here we go, it's game time. It's real gamer time, guys. Make sure we don't get killed by these fucking spiders. More remember, these guys don't take a lot of hits to kill. And they stagger. Was that three shots? Nice. Oh shit, son. Hmm. Oh, that was close. Little glass cannon fuckers. Heat knife would do against these guys, actually. If I get an opportunity, maybe I'll, uh. Hmm. Oh! Heat knife one shots! 
Oh, it doesn't one-shot. In fact, it does even kill. Oh, it does! It applies burn damage. Okay. It's not too bad, actually. I'm gonna tug this first, I believe. Oh, shit! Burn them all! Oh, fuck! That's not good. That's not good at all. Fuck. Little bastards. My leg! Hey! Collateral damage! Strikes again. I don't want to set the world on fire. I just want to start a flame in your heart. Is there anything here? Is it just me or these guys unlimited? I should probably actually get a move on if they're not. If there are, I mean. I've lost all ambition. It's almost like Fallout 76 is an actual anthem, only it failed. It didn't spark anything in anyone's heart. But it definitely set the world on fire, <laughs> and not in a good way. Flop. Edo Sofix, how's it going? Oh shit. Oh man, they even like do the spider thing when they die. They curl up. It's gross. Go, 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 go. Hmm? Well. Oh. oh shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck! Above! Go, keep on moving! Oh! Don't ask how I dodged that. Are you better on? Quick! Oh! Play it again, join a guitar. Shit! Oh, fuck. Easy, Tiger. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, don't fucking do that, dude. Shit. Oh god, let me think of something else. Uh, I, uh, uh, um... Oh, Lil Mac is the best character in Smash Bros. Oh, <laughs> Shit! There's so many! God, what's happening? Oh, this all went to shit all of a sudden. Fuck! Oh, oh my god, Jesus, oh shit, we survived with the skin of our teeth, oh shit, that was a close fucking call, that was tense, mate, yep, eat shit, yep, enjoy that sword dart slash little mac mean hive, Whew. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, Saber. I'm just saying how it is.
Good as new. Get that out, get that out, because we all know what's coming up next. Yes, indeedy. Hang on, I'll go on the edge. That's better. I wouldn't say where the edge was. Time for a monkey knife fight on the ship. Carlos, it's Jill. I've restored power to the subway. Nice going. Next up is the traffic control system. It should be in the subway company's offices. That's okay, Saber. Right. Your counters do far more damage than a hive could ever could. Way to go, partner. One step ahead. Not your partner. Oh. That one moment will forever give me PTSD. Alright, well, it's time for the game specific challenge. Knives out. Let's compare. Oh god, his is so much bigger than mine. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Of course, he's got combos. Wow, that was lit. Oh, whoa, that was awesome! I didn't know there were like slow mo moves for the knife, too. That's actually sick. Oh shit, it's got roars. Oh! Oh. You got me. <laughs> I can do a thing about that. I was literally stun locked in place. Well, at least we're seeing more of Nemesis' animations. We're not just down at him in one grenade. That was a pretty sick dodge though, not gonna lie. We get a sick animation too. That was awesome. Oh, fantastic start. Oh, so good. <laughs> oh, you've done a good one, Neon. You've done a very good one. Do not expect a good grade from this run at all, because we're dicking about more than anything. Stores. Bad dog, bad. Wow! I couldn't do a thing. Mate, if you're getting hit by the first, you're gonna get hit by the second. Nemi is esports. Yeah, it's an Android 16 main, 100%. I have no other option. Oh! Oh! oh no, here comes the second. Oh, fuck. Dude's got full screen command grabs and everything. Oh, oh God, oh, oh, I tried. I tried to do a cool guy thing, but I immediately got slapped. Fuck. Here comes a second. Oh, shit. It's like Muhammad Ali versus me. More like Mike Tyson versus everyone. Oh my god, do I try? Try all the time. In this institution. And she prays! Oh, oh my god, do I pray. I pray for the day I'm gonna get a hit in. <laughs> Is this possible? You shitting me? I am Ben, you can play right next to the Shiva sex video with you involved. Oh boy. I don't mean that in a nice way either.
So this is how it feels to be up against Ganondorf. With tentacles. Is this what people see when I play Gandalf? That's horrible! What am I doing? Oh! I keep getting too shotted! This is the worst! My great- my rank's probably already like F was fucking Z at this rate. Three more tries, you could try other weapons or just run. It's okay! I'm gonna I'm gonna keep on going. Until there is no hope left. Bad dodge. Oh. Third? Third! Oh, it got me! Seriously! Jackhammer! Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> I can't do it, Crow. I can't dodge like Solaire in that one Comic Con video. It's impossible. I've got too much weight on me. I'm fat rolling too much. There we go. Here comes second. God, that dodge is really hard. To Did you just do a come at me, bro pose? Or was that just me? Last he finished, he had his arms out and was, and was like thrusting his chest at the camera or some shit. He pose at me. Bad dodge. Are you? Here comes a second. Oh boy. Yep. Yep. Punish rolls. Fuck. Nemesis has got some good reads. Dodge the hand tie. I can't believe I'm doing this. This is a lot funner than the base game. Ha! <laughs> because it's more nemesis. This is his true calling. Are you me? To challenge me in a knife fight. Oh man, that count as a hit as well. Oh! <laughs> right into the bin. Imagine if I landed right in the bin with my legs off. That would have been absolutely hilarious. <laughs> oh, I see you there, Ben. Thanks for stopping by. It honestly looked like Jill's body went in the bin, which is quite funny. All right, Nemesis, I've got a big long thing, and you've got an even bigger long thing. But I can't let your bigger long thing be better than my longer thing, even though it's longer. But mine's on fire! You bitch! Oh, fuck! That was honestly terrifying. He shakes his fist. I could reuse that scorpion chain right now for this knife. Fuck! Oh no, here comes two! Oh. Jesus! He's not playing around this time. He always steps me when I'm dead as well. I can't enjoy you stepping on me, you nemesis. I'm dead. I can't enjoy anything when I'm dead. Oh my god, that hit me. Oh! I got backhanded. I just got pimp smacked! Oh man. You me? This has got to be doable. Ah! 
Oh. Sure you can. Oh fuck. And I'm dead. <laughs> oh shit. That was an attempt. That was an attempt. I'm dodging way too early. Like, I can sense that the timing for the perfect dodge is literally like the frame before it hits you. So it's better if I do late dodges more than early dodges. Wow. Like that. That's better timing. Fuck. Oh, I failed to save the game. <laughs> okay. Well, I, that's okay. I'm continuing here anyway. Teenage nemesis. Right, mum. Things are gonna be different around here. This beats for shit out of his own mother. He really is Mike Tyson. That's not Mike Tyson, that's Dredrick Tatum. The Simpsons equivalent. Oh, the axe kick! It is Ganondorf! Oh! Go, 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 go! Run! Move! I win! He's down! And he's not dropping anything! That's the worst! I don't feel rewarded at all except for my pride! Does that, did that not count as me getting him? Does, did I get him or not? I don't think he's down yet. No! Oh, he's a fake out! Oh my god! Oh, that was such an attempt. The did dop did ducking, diving, and dodging was all there, and he was on his knees. And I underestimated him. I had a monologue, super villain monologue, and then bam, got your leg, bitch. Oh shit! What a dick, clever girl. It was a total fake out. You shitting me? Oh, the Incredibles. You slide dog, you got me monologuing, I can't believe it. Oh! Sure you can! Oh! <laughs> And he steps on my shoulder. Oh, me! I'm not feeling it. After that attempt, and after getting him on one knee, and then just suddenly get dragged back by the tentacle, that was the worst thing. I don't want to risk it, Eon, because I might electrocute myself. Mind you, what is another death compared to what's happening right now? Oh my god, there's Zambambos there. Yeah, that that's yeah, no, that's that's not happening. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh no. Doria! Doria! Yeah, I'm getting fucking Doria in the video game. Spider-Man gamer, thank you for the follow. Oh, <laughs> you fight the zombies if the zombies are in the way of Nimi, but actually getting past them is another problem all in its own.
Shit. Shit. Oh, fuck. Some practicing his combos in the UMVC. Yeah, this is how he practiced. He practiced on my run. We need some montage music while I get my shit kicked in. We're gonna need a montage. Even Rocky had a montage. Fuck it. I think it's time for silent concentration mode. You guys enjoy video games with no commentary, don't you? Kidding me. What the fuck kind of hitbox was that? The big that wasn't even a cone, that was like that was like a fucking circle with like a cheese slice taken out of it. It's a shade now for me for vengeance. <laughs> There's a grab. Oh god, he's got a, he's got close up command grab as well. Wow. My son fist would be not clickbait. <laughs> the sequel to I fingered my son when he turned into the bed of chaos. Always with the slow mood. Always. Well, it was nice knowing you. He basically, it's basically him screaming GG when he stuns you like that. He goes GG and ends you. GG <gasps> What the f 
I've been clotheslined the fuck out of me! What was that? Nemesis just did a limit break and clotheslined me right in the jaw! Mate, that was the attempt! That was the attempt! What was that? He just vaulted off the floor and I don't even know where he went! Did you do like a cool parkour wall jump and slam onto me? <laughs> Fucking hell. I don't know why I'm still doing this. This is absolutely insane. Oh, I got to destroy you can. Fuck. He is too angry to die. He's on fire. I've stabbed him in his weird heart container thing. I don't think this is possible. I mean, it is possible, but we're going to be here for a long time attempting to do it. Oh, I can't even see. All I see is fire and brimstone. Oh, what a fucking beast. Just doing Yakuza Kiryu beast mode stuff now. I actually bet that his command grab is just a big old bear hug. Might as well let him grab me because when he whiffs it, it hurts me. Oh, bollocks! Oh, when you're so close to victory, you just want to keep on going out until you've got it. So depressing when that happens. Oh, that combo really hurts. damage that way. When I try to attempt it, it ends up hurting me. Oh, bollocks. Shit. That was an attempt as well. That was such an attempt. To... Don't you dare go hollow. Need the sinister laughter to accompany it as well. Wow. 
Oh my god. Wow! Okay, so don't go point blank into him when he does tent Siva because you're just gonna get slapped in the face. Yeah, I was thinking that too, but even when he does tentacles, like... like if I try to avoid the tentacle swipe, I'll take damage. But if I get hit by it, he'll just grab me. But I won't take damage from it. So when he does it, I might as well just, like, you know, take the ill. Number one. Oh, that's unlucky. Number one. Shit. It's a I can't believe this is the stream. <laughs> I thought this would be just like a five minute thing, but no. Joe's got to go and do the thing that he started. Are you shitting me? And he's a damn thick headed fool. Hey, grab me, it's fine. I actually go, I can actually have an attempt to stab him when he grabs me. Oh! I'm dead. Bye. Quality content I sought for. Not a fan, get away from me. Get away from me! Oh, oh, oh! The thing is, my time is up too. I don't have to do this for Chris, but the fact that I was so close to succeeding makes me want to do it. Plus, I, I sort of want to see that big ROM movie you did as well. The hardest boss fight in the game is knifing Nemesis. Backhand. Pick it back. Oh, I dodged as well. Are you shitting me? You shitting me? <laughs> what the hell is this? It seems to always get me. I'm gonna get hit again. just attempt to, to get past the zombies. I'm going to attempt to shoot all of them in the head with the magnum. And then I'm going to see what I can do with the knife on the electric thing. It's right there! I missed! Oh god, no! Oh god, no! Don't combo me! No! What the fuck is going on? Oh, <laughs> oh I didn't die! <laughs> well, I mean, that's kind of a thing, I guess. The only thing is that the fucking zombies are in the way. The only way for that to work is if I just get rid of those zombies. I'll try it again. I've got a shotgun shell as well. Are 
Oh, I killed them too. F what? Did you see that? <gasps> did you guys see that fucking like wave dash he did? That was terrifying. I don't think that was a glitch. Mate, nothing personal, kid. You see that? Okay, I think I've got to fuck him over here before I do anything. You know what? What if I just kill one zombie and I try and get past? Let's try that. No, I got what? No, I got one more comboed. That ain't Chris. <laughs> what if I just don't try and kill the zombies? But what if I try and trust in my in my epic gamer skills and I try and dodge the zombie? Get away from me! Get away from me! Get away from me! Oh, I did it when Nemesis wasn't there. <laughs> okay, this isn't what I imagined. <laughs> okay. I have to go away from Nemesis to get in my range before I stab the electric thingy. Even now, I don't think it's gonna help me. It'll get it'll help me get a few hits in, but So if we're too far away, he'll do that. Okay. It's actually really epic what he does. That wasn't what he did when he was floored, was it? It might have been. Second one. Shit. Back to life, please. All right, let's see what you do this time. It's back alive. Kill me. Why won't you die?
guys, I don't think this is possible. That took everything. I can't, not again. <laughs> I'm simply not strong enough to try that all over again. Oh my fucking Christ. Oh. <sighs> I felt that. I felt that in my veins. I felt that in my bollocks. I felt that was the one, but alas, it was not meant to be. God, is this even possible with the heat knife? I'm not sure. I don't know. <sighs> Do you know what? I'm going to give it three more attempts. I'll give it three more attempts and... If I don't do it, I'll win the stream. God, uh, when victory is this gets this close every single time, you just can't help but try, 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 and try again. It's the farewell chapter from Celeste all over again. <laughs> oh man, I try my best, guys. Watch me just slowly unlearn all of this. Oh, oh, thanks, Nemi! You fucking asshole! <laughs> oh, Atlas. The last word I see before I die. The last name I curse before I go to hell. Grammy. You fucking arsehole, and so history repeats itself. I'd rather do this with no damage, but hey. We're basically doing ship damage. Oh my god. Uh, th this is like a. This is Devil May Cry, a, like level of damage where you're just like pressing square of the guns on like the savior or something uh, every knife swipe is a gunshot nightmare knife only nemesis is really popular Zombies. No! You're ruining everything! Well, past on you. Oh my god! The timing on that! Did you see that? <laughs> Oh my god, Ruka Sog, you, you literally timed that. You couldn't have timed that any better. As soon as the arm goes down, we get the sound bite. That was honestly amazing. Alright, last attempt. Oh, you can beat the final boss with a regular knife. This ain't a knife run and only run. This is... This is an... <laughs> This is just a request that got way too out of hand because of uh, my personality. That is really cool though. And he killed the zombies.
Oh. I think, uh, I think that's going to be it for tonight, ladies and gents. Uh, I apologize for keeping you guys waiting with my very flawed personality traits of bumping my head against a brick wall for half an hour, but <laughs> I'm glad some of you enjoyed it regardless. Uh, I said before and I say it again, when the wind is dangling, when I'm being baited so hard by a uh, a possible win. It's just I can't stop going for it. Oh my god. Next time on Resi will free, we're gonna we're gonna continue the rest of the nightmare run through with weapons. Oh man, that was fun though. I mean like I, I gotta admit, even though that was highly painful, uh, it was still fun regardless. It was a it was a nice mess around. I mean uh, like like vanilla game was still fun. But this was actually super fun doing this. It's funny, really. Like, in the end, I guess we've got to make our own fun to make it, like, you know, the best experience. But, yeah. At least the game gives us the option to do that. So, got to give it credit for that. Okay, people. That is going to be it. See you guys next time. Take care, everyone. And good night. Bye-bye.